already. This, this was just small potatoes to him. Uh, he had a very successful uh, uh, engineering company up in Wigan, Preston. And, uh, and, I, and he, th this was just something that he was doing on, on the side. But I thought, what an amazing concept. He's running his company, his engineering company, but in the background, every day, he's got these orders that come in. He's got these orders that come in. And, well, basically what happened was, I called him up. Do you remember what I said about asking for help? I said, Francis, listen, I haven't, had, I haven't earned a dime in five months. Funnily enough, I met him the month that I got fired, uh, November. I met him on the 11th of November, 2003, and uh, I got fired on, on the 30th. And, um, uh, actually, no, th I got fired that same week, but they let me go uh, at the end of the month. And uh, I called him up and said, Francis, listen, and we we're about April time, beginning of April. I said, Francis, you know what? I've got I've to find a way, maybe mid of April, sorry. Uh, I've got to find a way how to, how to make the things work financially for me because I am completely, completely broke. I have a place to live. I've sold all of my possessions. I've only got a suitcase of clothes and my PC. I was still trying to sell my PC, my computer. So I have my computer, bag of clothes, and my rollerblades. I wasn't going to get parted for, for my rollerblades. I love my rollerblading. And, uh, yay, says Ami, good. <laughs> and uh, and uh, I... Um, I just called him and said, you know, I, I need help. I need help. <laughs> Do you have a job? No. I didn't ask him for a job the second time. I said, Francis, remember e-books? Uh-huh. Does that, does that still work? I was very dubious about it, but still it, it made sense to me that you could create something that was sold over and over and over again using the internet and you could reach 600 million people. At that time, uh, that was the figure that was quoted to me, 600 million people. And I was thinking, that kind of leverage, that makes sense to me. That, that it, it must work. It must work. If you can reach such a huge amount of people for very little money, then this must make financial sense. I said, Francis, does it still work? He said, yes, it's still working. In fact, it's growing without me doing anything. I've got new affiliates, people who are selling this for me for commission, and uh, it's going very well. It's going very well. In fact, I'm going to start a few more e-books. I said, Francis, listen, I've got to find out. Uh, okay, I'll work for you for free. I'll work. You remember what I said about don't go to successful people and just say, you know, give me, give me, give me. I said, okay, Francis, I'm going to work for you for free. Just tell me what you need me to do. I'll do it. I just want to learn how to do these these ebooks. I said, don't worry about it. Uh, he had loads of employees anyway, and he said, don't worry about it. Yeah, it's easy. And he took it took him just an afternoon to show me and share with me everything he knew about ebooks. And when I look back on it, he didn't share with me that much about it. What he said to me was, go to ClickBank, ClickBank.com, go and use Google AdWords at adwords.google.com and check out a few other ebook websites. And that's, that's about it. And uh, while I did that, I, I, did, I followed his system. He had actually, there's a little bit more to it, and, uh, and I'll share that with you as well. And uh, I just followed his system. And for the next 20, I was so jazzed, by the way, when I found out about this. I found out how to do it exactly. And for the next 28 days, I wrote my first ebook. I told myself about HTML code and how to design a website. I uh, told myself about mo a bit more about online marketing. I went to all of the websites that he suggested to me and, and I worked around them and I tried to figure out how, how that worked. And by the end of 28 days, uh, I had my first website up. It only cost me, I think, about 250 pounds. 250 pounds in total. 250 pounds that I didn't have and I had to put on a credit card, which uh, that was another story, another nightmare, but anyway. and. Uh, but with 250 pounds, I launched my first ebook website, and I, I still have the um, um, the website. It's now diabetes diabetes dash breakthroughs diabetes dash breakthroughs dot com diabetes dash breakthroughs dot com. And it's exactly the same model as all these other ebooks. It's like, hello, this is me. This is what you're gonna get. Here are some benefits. Here's what you need to find out. Here are some testimonials of people who've read my ebook. 